Hi, I'm Dr. Courtney Campbell, and in this video, we'll discuss three ways you can calm a stressed dog. If your dog suffers from fear, anxiety, or stress, it's tough on your dog, and it's also unsettling to their families. By helping your dog maintain a calm, more relaxed, and less stressful state of mind, it will most importantly help your dog, but it will also help you. Watch this video and learn easy tools to help your dog overcome their anxiety. To be sure, always contact your veterinarian or veterinary behaviorist when discussing ways to help treat anxiety in your dog. To be sure, medical conditions, medications, pain, hormone imbalances, and less obvious conditions can all be the cause of anxious behaviors, and behavioral training by itself may not be effective. If you'd like to learn more and get daily tips and content about fun and easy ways to help your dog be happier, less stressed, better behaved, subscribe to Dog TV's YouTube channel now. Just hit the subscribe button and become Dog TV's new pack member. And in case you were wondering, Dog TV is the first and only channel for dogs with scientifically developed programs to keep your dog calm and happy when you're away or when you're at home. Dog TV has thousands of stress reducing programs, all colored in colors dogs can see, with the music and sound that was proven by studies to reduce stress and relax anxiety. Here are three ways you can calm a stressed dog. Antecedent arrangement. Prevention is the name of the game. If your pet is anxious due to specific noise like fireworks, traffic, or vuvuzelas during the World Cup, find a way that you can help your pet avoid these sounds. Essentially, prevent the behavior by avoiding exposure to the problematic stimulus. Try to avoid leaving your pet at home during stressful situations. Think about calling a pet sitter, calling a friend or the neighbors, consider day boarding your pet at a local vet clinic or a daycare, or try working from home on those specific days if possible. If your dog doesn't like traffic noise, find a different region of the house where they can be somewhat shielded from traffic noise. In situations with fireworks, your dog could be boarded in a soundproof facility or housed at a place less likely to play fireworks. Consider playing competing background noises like the TV, radio, or you can even use a white noise maker to diminish more problematic noises. Some animals may also benefit from listening to classical music or specific environmental enrichment tools like dog TV. Number two, the three A's, the aware, affirm, and award approach. The key to this program is that your dog will learn to consistently follow you and your commands at home and in other stressful situations, which makes them easier to follow these commands in potentially challenging situations like when they're distracted or when they're anxious. This approach fits all dogs and all people, regardless of breed, age, size, gender, or personality type. Your dog's behavior will improve and your bond will become even tighter through trust. Your dog's confidence and their connection to you will be better because you'll provide clear communication and rewards for desired behaviors. This approach only uses positive reward-based training methods as a teaching method. You'll center every interaction with your pet based on command, response, and reward, or CRR. The key is to be aware of the good behavior, affirm that behavior by giving feedback, communicate to your dog at the time of the behavior, and then reward any positive behavior, especially when they are the opposite of the behaviors you don't want. Now, before the last point, it's worth just stopping and checking to see if your dog truly indeed does suffer from stress. Ask yourself the following. Does your dog seem to pant or pace or become restless when you're about to leave the house? How about when you leave the house? Do you hear a lot of barking? Have they perhaps destroyed property? And are your neighbors complaining? If the answer is yes, these may be all ways that your dog is stressed. Now let's get to number three. Number three, tools. You'll need the right tools for the job, and that's certainly the case when it comes to correcting anxiety behaviors in your dogs. And there are plenty of good tools available. A tool in this sense is any equipment that will help you with your reward-based program. There are specific recommendations based on what your dog likes, but more broadly speaking, these tools include clickers, target sticks, remote-controlled reward systems, streets, relaxation mats, interactive toys, music, and visual entertainment like dog TV. There are many, many more. Less desirable training tools like anti-bark devices, shock collars, prong collars, and other pain and fear eliciting items that are used typically in punishment, 
These tools suppress behaviors rather than help teach positive new behaviors. This can lead to fear, anxiety, and even aggression. Whether your dog suffers from anxiety or not, Dog TV can help. Dog TV is one of the main solutions for easing stress, anxiety, and overcoming loneliness in a non-medicinal way. I recommend trying Dog TV for seven days free and experience its positive effect on your dog almost immediately.